This is a demonstration of the virtual reference feedback tuning algorithm. The system we will try to control is a second order RCL filter. The system can have its dynamics change, changing the value of resistor R1. This is the interface to the system. On the top graph you can see the reference and the plant outputs and on the bottom the controller. The system is operating in open loop so I will change the resistor to change its dynamics making it faster or slower. Ok, I will keep it right here. Now let's try to manually adjust the PID loop. To start, let's clean the proportional integral and derivative terms and keep the proportional term to 1. Let's run and close the loop. OK, there is a big error in this the response. Let's increase the value, the proportional value. That's not so good. Let's step down a little bit to do some propor integral term. I think that is too much. Now we'll just change the values to try to get a better response. You can skip this part if you want. As you can see, it's a iterative process. It can take a while. But we are getting there. Now let's try the VRFT method. Now I am back at the open loop configuration and I will activate the VRFT algorithm. Now it's generating some parameters based on this experiment. Here you can see a plot of some of the parameters. Okay. Let's try to run with some of this. Let's keep this one and go. Close it loop. It's a nice and slow step response. This is because A, which is the desired velocity of the response, is too large. So let's run the algorithm again with a smaller value. One nice thing is we can run this algorithm in closed loop. It's a much better response. Can try to speed it up a little bit. Let's collect some data on open loop configuration. Now we have a much better response. Now let me try a different thing. Here's the system in closed loop. I will change to open loop. Now I will make the system a lot faster and more oscillating. OK. Let's see the closed loop response. It's a lot worse, but we can run the algorithm again to compensate for the system change. It's generating new parameters. Now let's use it. Different system, almost the same response.